What's up guys, it's Matters, and we're going to be looking at some teasers actually found within the Zetsubu no Shima trailer that hint at the Skull of Nan Sapwe and the Wonder Weapon being within the map and different things, ritual tables and different stuff, you may need to actually build and achieve this Wonder Weapon, this sort of storm, I guess, thunder gun based weapon like we've talked about time and time again, and if you guys want to know again, it's been in the code, it was leaked, and it looks like it's actually going to come, but we're going to be looking at stuff that may be sort of elements and possibilities to actually build it that again what were teased in the trailer obviously if we actually saw the whole wonder weapon that would be a lot more interesting to talk about we, but we still have a lot of really cool stuff to actually cover here within this video so if you can please give a like for Zetsubu no Shima DLC 2 and the hype for the wonder weapon let's try to get 100 likes and let's get started now this video is actually going to be a part of a couple different things here we have a picture from Lord Spingham's video so definitely I'll leave a link to his channel check him out as a really cool guy and then also just like the random drop from the trailer that everyone's trying to wonder and like figure out like what is this drop like what the hell is it so there's a lot of different things here but it may tie into the wonder weapon this is one of the possibilities and we're going to go over those in this video so the first one here obviously is the more popular one which is the drop sort of this little skull fish looking thing it was puffer fish it's really weird a lot of people had different names for different pictures resembling it um and it's a really really weird drop and it has the same sort of special effect as the death machine because usually the normal drops are green like double points max ammo nuke etc but this has the same sort of blue effect indicating that it's not just a normal drop it has to do something in the game and it does something a bit different than what we would normally see now obviously that can mean a couple of things, it could mean that maybe it's just another thing that you use to actually kill zombies with, or like an actual mechanical thing that gives you some sort of ability of some sort, because obviously the death machine's blue, gives you the death machine, and then this, this little like ball shaped thing uh, is blue as well, so it may give you some sort of mechanical thing as well, but really back to the wonder weapon, we can see quite simply just killing zombies within, sh especially Sha Shadows of Evil, killing zombies, guess what you would get once you kill the zombies at just a random points? the Xenomatter, and you need the Xenomatter for the one weapon, so that's definitely something very interesting to talk about, obviously Xenomatter had its distinct color, its distinct sort of shape, could be the same thing here, and also with killing the Margwa, you got the Margwa heart, another thing with killing zombies and killing the boss, you get these pieces towards the one weapon, obviously very prevalent within Shadows of Evil, um, Dreisendrock a bit less prevalent, but you still see it with like the Ragnarok, killing the Panzer, you get a part to the Ragnarok, it's still there, but Shadows of Evil is a lot more prevalent, it was really cool, and just saying this could be towards the one drop and you never know um and also there's a good chance as well it could be just like another ability that you achieve to actually kill zombies and stuff like that now we're gonna we're gonna be looking at the picture from lord Spingham. it's actually very cool because he pointed out something a lot of people actually missed and it's a ritual table in this new map and it's a certain point in the gameplay trailer this is actually from his video his little arrow and stuff um so definitely like i said shout out to him it's really interesting obviously you can clearly see the ritual table with the skull um uh, he talks about the skull being like the main point of why he saw that and how he picked it out out of the rest of like the actual like cuts and images and sort of pixels that he actually um framed I i'm guessing he did something frame by frame or something like that because it does look pretty interesting it's pretty hard to see but uh, you can sort of see with the trailer or no, with the actual arrow pointing at it. Um, again, another really interesting thing, pointing at sort of these things you would need to actually build and get ready to get the wonder weapon. Other than that, there were a lot of other sort of electrical things found within the map. A lot of weird sort of electrical power lines leading to certain key points. And I'm, I'm saying key points as in places sort of of interaction, places that you would actually have to walk up to and pull a lever and a lot of random stuff within the trailer. You're going to see the trailer in the background, like slow mode. You're going to see going through the map just different stuff that seems pretty interesting you do have electrical traps but then you have things which I believe again this is just a possibility here it's from the trailer um, but that I believe that you actually have to activate stuff around the map like move mechanical parts around the map to actually achieve different parts for the wonder weapon or to actually progress with the actual wonder weapon getting it or upgrading it you never know really um, but there's a lot of really cool stuff that you have to actually mechanically do and I think it's pretty cool because within Drazadrak and past maps it's really just been sort of this solid thing like you do this you go here But with the actual map moving and parts of the map legit moving you can see it You actually have to activate a lever and then this water slide opens like stuff from like Shangri-La with the Easter egg And you have to use the water slide like stuff like that where you actually Incorporate the parts of the map to do the wonder weapon steps or the Easter egg and stuff like that That would be really really cool and hopefully they do add that in so we did have a couple teasers potentially of what the wonder weapon will be in this map but as 
of now, we'll just have to see. So, hope you guys enjoyed. And, uh, yeah, tell me guys what you think. I'll see you guys later.